Radford University officially welcomes its new leader on campus. Brian Hemphill became the school's new president just a few months ago. He succeeds Radford's first female president, Penelope Kyle. WSLS 10's Bethany Teague has more from today's inauguration. What's up? The story traditions, the familiar songs, the ceremony steeped in symbolism all make way for a new chapter at Radford University. A new, a fresh, what some would call invigorating wind blew into the River City. His name is President Brian Hemphill. Thursday, Dr. Brian Hemphill was officially inaugurated as the university's seventh president. Here he laid out his vision to faculty, staff, and students. We've pledged to focus on six areas, brand identity, academic excellence and research, student success, strategic enrollment growth, economic development and community partnerships, and philanthropic giving and alumni engagement. Hempel took office a few months ago and says he wants Radford University to be a place where dreams come true for people from every walk of life. Regardless of race, creed, color, or economic background, access must remain a top priority. No one should be denied an education based on affordability. The inauguration also came with a challenge. Innovation must be our new normal. But first, a gift from the hundreds of Radford graduates represented in the crowd Another bow tie for Hempel's already infamous collection. We hope that you remember that we, you have 72,000 alumni standing behind you. And also a challenge of their own for the new leader. Be loud, be proud, go Highlanders. In Radford, Bethany T, WSLS 10.